Listen, I don't know if it's fucking just Republicans or conservatives or if Democrats are involved in this at all either, but it seems to be uh, Lauren Boebert's biggest fucking issue, which is uh, if, if employees are working from home, are they clocking in and putting in the same amount of time? Are they getting the hours? Are they getting the work done? Blah, blah, blah. Like, yeah. Like, of course they are. You, you, you think a job's not going to pay attention to if their employees are punching in or not or getting their job actually done? It's, it's literally the same exact fucking thing as if they were at work. Like, at a physical fucking job. Like, they don't have to leave their homes to do their job, then they don't have to leave their homes to do their job. Like, she is beyond fucking stupid. Lauren Boebert is a fucking waste of fucking air. The fact that fucking Colorado has fucking voted for her and kept her, absolutely fucking nuts. And then she fucking can't win against the fucking person she's going against in her fucking district. So what does she do? She moves. She goes and applies to a different district. That'll possibly favor her more than the one that she lives in so she just gives up on her constituents and moves to a different fucking area she is so stupid anyone in colorado voting for her you're a fucking retard like beyond fucking stupid same with fucking marjorie taylor green you have to be a fucking idiot to vote for any either one of those two fucking morons like you have to be as dumb as them they are literally doing nothing in congress they are wasting Money. They are wa- wasting American fucking taxpayers' money by having them in Congress doing absolutely fucking nothing. So for all the fucking Democrats, all the Republicans, and all the conservatives that think, oh, our Congress people are the best, they shouldn't just be removed. It should just be voted in by the people. Well, you know what? They should be fucking removed by the people as well. So if they're not doing their job and the fucking people in that district are like, hey, this fucking person is shit. This is not what we voted for. Fucking instant fire them. Don't just wait until oh next election while they're collecting taxpayer money to, to fucking fill their pockets with. No, get rid of them immediately. There shouldn't, there shouldn't be any of this, oh, we got to wait until next election bullshit. Same with fucking Trump. Same with fucking Biden. Same with anyone in government. If you see them doing something wrong and it is literally against the fucking law or they're just pointless fucking people to have in government, fucking get rid of them. If they are not actually doing anything to help the fucking people, just get rid of them. Don't even fill, don't even refill their fucking spots at this point. Just get rid of them. It's the same fucking, it would be the same and we'd be at least saving money. So get rid of those fucking Congress people, get rid of the president, get rid of fucking anyone fucking running for president that's a piece of shit. Like, just stop with these fucking idiot people. Like, and, and people wonder why other countries look at as uh, America as a fucking shithole. Like, they look at us as a fucking joke. And this is why, because our, our fucking government is trash. From head to toe, fucking trash. Everyone in it, Trash. You've got a few people that's trying to do something good, but they can't do anything fucking good because of everyone else voted in. And instead of fucking doing anything to get those people out, they go, oh, well, they were voted in by the people, so it's what the people want. No. No. We have seen over the fucking, like, 10 years now, we've seen so many people get voted in by constituents, and then they fucking flip on their constituents. Those people should automatically go to fucking jail. Fetterman, go to jail. Fucking, uh, that other fucking idiot from Arizona, she should go to fucking jail. Uh, that other fucking one that pretended he was a fucking Democrat, he should go to jail. Like, you shouldn't be running and stealing people's votes and then turning around and doing exactly the opposite of what the fucking constituents voted you in for. That's, it's so fucking corrupt and so stupid If this was any other fucking country, these people would be removed by force and fucking dragged through the fucking streets, and then we'd fucking replace them with someone decent. But no, we're a fucking dumb fucking country that likes to be ruled by fucking right-wing idiots. And then the left-wing is just fucking bows down to them because 
oh, we got to do things the democracy way. We got to do things, you know, in a, in a democracy way. We got to vote people in and vote them out. Well, if you can't fucking vote them out, you got to do something else. You just have to fucking remove them. It's, it's not a democracy if, if one side is fucking ruining everything for the country. That's, it's not democracy at all. That's like saying uh, when, when Hitler took over fucking Germany and had the fucking Nazis run in Germany that, oh, that was just a democracy. He, he was voted in. It was all fucking, it was all done fucking democracy-like. Well, if fucking shit like that's going to happen, then that's not democracy. Or democracy is not what people thought it was. Democracy is just not fucking people being able to vote. There's other things to it besides that. There's like literally helping the fucking people of the country, not trying to make things terrible for them. <laughs> like, this is just fucking plain stupid logic that like anyone should fucking, anyone born should just fucking know this. But no. We have literal fucking idiots running our country, and for some reason we just allow it. We just allow it. We allow the dumbest people in our nation to run our country. And because they talk fancy and, and they know big words, and they say a bunch of fucking legal mumbo-jumbo that only fucking people in, in fucking Congress or courts will fucking understand, that they're so smart. Basically, everyone in fucking Congress is like Ben Shapiro. They talk fast, they say big words... And you, you can't understand them, but they sound smart. And then when you finally figure out what the fuck they're saying, it's like, whoa, dude, you're a fucking moron. Why, are you, why is anyone listening to you? That's Congress. Congress is just a fucking Ben Shapiro fucking wannabe. That's all Congress is. They're just trash.